students in this video we are going to see one of the basic property of a system that is the stability as we know a stable means it should not deviate or it should not increase in terms of magnitude so what we can say for the stable system for any bounded input we should get a bounded output so we can call this as a bebo stability criteria of a system bebo stands for bounded input bounded output or here it is very important to have a bounded input and obviously it will give a bounded output in case of a stable system as we have seen in a stable system the magnitude should not increase if i am giving a finite sequence at the input side meaning let's take an example of system which is having x of t as the input it is a unit step we call this as a bounded input because if i say i want to plot a graph it will be like this so no matter what is the value of t from 0 to infinity my x of t will have the magnitude 1 so it's a bounded input if this is the input signal given to a system which is given by y of t equals e raised to minus at x of t so what we will get at the output side we will get a plot like this whose value is converging it becomes zero at t tending to infinity so i can call this as bounded output so system represented by y of t e raised to minus at x of t will be a stable system let's take an example of unstable system so i'll call this as stable system because the magnitude of output of the system is converging it becoming a finite it is not increasing with t the example for unstable system will be like this slight change i'll make to the previous example and let's have y of t as e raised to a t x of t and i'm assuming a is positive value so if you plot this i can say y of t will be like this is exponentially increasing meaning what its values keep on accumulating keep on increasing so in the end i will get a magnitude tending to infinity so for a 
boundary input where x of t is the input is nothing but u of t a bounded input but the response I am getting over here is unbounded. Unbounded output. So what I can say, I am having a bounded input and unbounded output. I can say y of t is, which is e raised to a t u of t, a unstable system. So for a stable system, if I'm giving a fixed amount or fixed magnitude input, I should get a fixed amount of output only without increasing as t tending to infinity. This is what about a stable system. Thank you.